Kendo, meaning way of the sword, is a modern Japanese martial art of sword fighting based on traditional swordsmanship or Kenjutsu. It originated with the samurai class of feudal Japan. This ancient and mystical art form basically involves guys beating each other with big sticks. The perfect excuse for a particularly extreme gadget test. We've got these two laptops, which, because we're doing a round the world tour, uh, we, back in the office a few weeks ago, chose a couple of cases for them that were really hardy and really strong and, and rugged, because everything we need is on these laptops. Our plan was to protect ourselves against the kendo masters, using the laptops in their protective cases. Firstly, we had the G-Form Extreme Sleeve, which is made of Poron XRD. This material feels light and flexible to hold, but if it's hit, the molecules within interlock to create a hard surface, which can absorb 90% of the impact energy. And secondly, we'd be testing the Pelican 1095 hardback. Pelly cases are made from an incredibly tough copolymer resin and for 30 years have set industry standards when it comes to protecting sensitive electronic equipment. This laptop's used for scripts, call sheets, briefs. So if this gets damaged, everyone back home's asleep at the moment, we're going to be stuck. Yeah, they'll be, they'll be fine, I said. I've got a formidable opponent in that case, but you know what? I reckon this little G4 might just do the job. Oh, yeah, ready to do some damage. So, with the cases ready, it was now time for us to get prepared. Ready to go into battle. Cool. <laughs> I feel invincible. The lady that's translating for us told them that this, or an iteration of this for the iPad, has been dropped from space 100,000 feet, uh, and it survived. And so, in a sort of, you know, for a sense of honour, I think they're pretty serious about hitting it very hard. And first up was the G-form. The concussive force kind of built the vibration, the kind of waves of vibration kind of started to build, which is why I kind of crumpled to my knees. My fingers and my wrists are completely numb. <laughs> that was terrifying. That laptop case took an absolute beating. And I'll be quite honest, yeah, I was scared. Scared or not, I was up next with the pen case. I was thinking, how am I going to hold on? The kendo master was hitting it that hard, my arms were killing within about five seconds. It was painful. <laughs> so, after both cases had received a thorough pounding, it was time to see how well they'd protected our precious production laptops, starting with the G-form. The screen's well, still intact. Yeah, the screen... Uh, no, wait! The screen! <laughs> the screen is cracked! That screen is completely ruined. Let's check out the pelly, see if it did any better. Can you just see that? Look, before you, before you <laughs> test it, can you see the beating. battering it's taken there? Can you see that in the light? Oh, it's looking good so far. That is a good noise. <laughs> That's really impressive. I mean, you can see the impact on the top of this pellet yeah. case. I think it's fair to say, in this instance, it survived. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> I am slightly concerned, though, because I... I sort of got permission <clears throat> to do this. Where do they think it is right now? I have no idea. But we'll, you know, we'll deal with it. <gasps> Just a thought. So it's a rather worrying two Gs for the G-Form's not quite so extreme sleeve, while the Pelly case gets the most honourable four Gs for withstanding everything a Kendo Master could throw at it. 